Can you move? Can you move? Messing up my YouTube stuff. <laughs> Hey y'all, it's Ladybug, Lady of the House. I'm back with another video. So today's video is going to be a little different. It's clips, as you can see. I'm going to show you how to make a money box. I made this as a Christmas present for my cousin from his girlfriend. But as you guys know, Love Day slash Valentine's Day is coming up very soon. So I'm going to show you how you can do this for your loved one for any time of the year. Okay, so quickly walking y'all through the steps. I went to my email, uh, I emailed these to the computer instead of printing from my phone because I was having trouble. So you want to download all of them. I downloaded them, save the name, go over here to your files. When you go to your files, you want to save all of them, which I did. Um, to select multiple at one time, click one, hold control, and then click the rest, and then right click and do what you got to do. Went to print, selected my printer, and it brings me here. So, the paper that I'm using is standard, um, paper. I'm sorry, the sizing. You want to go over here to paper type. I put glossy photo paper because this is what I'm using. Um, select your sizing. If I would have done full page photo, you see how that number changed? It goes to six. All of my pictures are going to be four by six inches. So I'm going to get two per sheet front side and I'm only going to have to use three sheets. And you could also change them that way if you want it. You can do five by seven. It still gives you two. And they give you more options. So like I said, when you were editing on your phone, just play around. You can print four on one depending on the size you want. Those are three by fives. Um, hmm. I'm seeing new things now. So just play around with your options, see which one you like, and then when you're ready, select your printer, click print. Okay guys, and here's a little tip. If some of your pictures are not as bright as you want or they're not the size you want, if you're anything like me and you got an iPhone, you can do most of your editing right here in the photos app and just straighten them, get them to a different size. You can play with your lighting, you know, your shadows, brightness and all that, just for a little pre printing editing <laughs> that was hard to say 